we're back with another anime from the summer 2023 anime season so without further ado let's go ahead and get started We got this beefy uh, guy. This is supposed to be, I'm guessing, the uh, hero that saved humanity years ago. Oh, he's gonna get one shotted, dude. Yep, one shotted. That's a different one that also got one shotted. Who is this? Was that him? Like, was he being like experimented on? Okay, we got some clean, we got some clean movements. Hell, could it? I mean, he's not even breaking a sweat. He's not even breaking a sweat, if we're being honest. Oh, oh, this opening is started off with a banger already. Dude, dude has what? An 8-pack. My guy has an 8-pack. He's just built differently, man. Dude, it's an absolute tank. All right, Helk the Hero. We're going to learn about him, I'm guessing, in episode one. Damn. All right, then. Damn. Where's an easy button? When you need one. This almost sounds like your typical isekai story. But of course, this is not an isekai. The deep green contract. I'm guessing that forces everybody to play by the rules. I'm guessing there's some sort of magic system behind it. Oh, that dude with the wings, he looks kind of cool. Level 45. Okay, I'm guessing the max level is 99. Right, imagine trying to pick a, a demon lord for your country. And uh, the person that's running, the, the favorite candidate is a hero from the human realm. I could see how there could be a conflict of interest there. Man, I don't know if anybody's getting the vibe. I despise humans, damn. But this kind of reminds me of Yu Yu Hakusho in the Dark Tournament. I mean, just the, the demons being there and a tournament being held. And just kind of like the art style and the colors. Uh, they, they definitely remind me highly of Yu Yu Hakusho. Wow, so that's a pretty OP contract then. Well, I wouldn't say powerless, but he just can't harm anybody outside of the uh, tournament, right? Because look at this. This dude is just swinging. He's just Chupacabra. Did that say Chupacabra? Oh, there's Chupabra. Okay. I, I was like, wait a minute. Okay, okay. They got me there. Oh, he's proving her wrong at every turn. I, I mean, I, I'm I'm with her. You know what I mean? Like she's trying to select the next demon lord, and a human hero shows up. That's a, the sketchy. I mean, uh, hey, he he seems to be a fan favorite. So I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, damn. I mean, I, I'm sorry, but again, when, if you put yourself in her shoes, you will probably be reacting like this. It, it obviously does seem like she's the only one with common sense over here. Hell, okay, so, oh, there it is, level 99. So yeah, nobody's going to beat him. Damn. But I mean, she she's definitely, I mean, she, she's blowing up a castle. You know what I mean? Like now somebody's going to have to come in and fix it. I, w I would also love to know how he does that. How you how you level up in this world? Bro, I have a feeling Helk is gonna just destroy that challenge. 
I have faith in Hulk. And I also want to see if he's actually going to pull this through, right? Because that's what's drawing me into this anime when, when I read the synopsis. Was like, is he actually going to be, you know, oh, look, Asta from Black Clover. He, 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 I mean, I, would, I wouldn't say he, he had a glow up. Uh, uh, he probably, you know, uh, got a downgrade on that one. But hey. But yeah, I want to see how, uh, how essentially Hulk, is he actually going to go through with destroying humankind? If he does become the next demon lord. And honestly, even the demons, man, they seem to be pretty chill. Like, they, they don't seem to be crazy. Some of them even look outright cute. I mean, we had a little cat demon over there, you know? Look, we had a little bunny demon. Kind of cute. Even a bear demon. Oh, he realizes they're messing with him. Oh, I feel bad for that one because it's too big for the cards. You all are underestimating my man. I must hone my skills. What does that eat? Well, hey, you know what? Smart. Smart. Nobody said that he couldn't knock over the other ones down. Oh, he got Ultra Instinct right here. GG will play. GG will play. Dude, dude is OP. He got it done. Never lost faith in him. <laughs> they, they, got, they got a dog demon, man. What the, man. Kenros, the Godspeed. I guess it's super fast. Bro, he just made a case for Hulk. Like, he just made a perfect case for Hulk right there. <laughs> yeah, I mean, hey, but it fits though. Oh, we, look, level 50, okay. Man, he just seems like a nice person. Oh, and of course, they start fighting. Oh, damn, she blew up the building again. Oh, level 48. Spy level. Spy level 48. And she got cat ears. Since she's got cat ears, this might actually be contender for anime of the year. Are they playing chess? Wow, bro, they're doing everything they can to try to get a hell cow, but it ain't working. Bruh. <laughs> hey, hey, man, he, he, he rocks it, though. What is that? Ooh, dessert. Oh, we're going to have a, a Shokugeki no Soma moment, aren't we? Clothes are about to start coming off. She gave it a 10. <laughs> she gave it a 10. I mean, hey, when you're great, you're great. You can't fight it. Oh, she's going to be exposed. Damn. That wing guy over there, he looked cool too. Oh, she's going to come out with something, ain't she? Oh, she put it back. Okay, okay. Bro, and whoever is over here rebuilding the castles, we got to give him props. She's destroyed the castle like two times already. Man, it's kind of weird, right? Because like, if you if, like, you watching Hulk, he behaves like a good guy, right? Like, does he really have intentions of destroying humans? Oh, he has an enormous bounty. As the worst criminal in all of humanity. Frat fratricide. Fr I believe that's killing your brother. Yeah, there you go. That's killing your brother. 
Oh, so that wasn't Helk? I thought that was Helk the whole time. I now, I don't believe he did that. Like, he just seems like such a good guy. I don't believe he did that. Now, of course, looks can be deceiving. This guy could be the worst thing ever. I think he got set up. Yo, please don't tell me he wiped them out. Please don't tell me Helk wiped them out. Man, they're really making it seem like the demons are the good guys here, you know what I mean? Oh, they're playing that game. Awesome. Hey, there's there's I would never forget that scene in One Punch Man, man. Saitama playing with the uh I forgot the old man's, but yeah, that scene was funny. Don't worry. You guys got help. Damn. Interesting. Next episode, we're going to find out if this guy is really the real deal. But all right, that was episode one of Helk. Helk. Uh, and I, I feel like this anime is one of those that can be a relaxing, funny anime, but can also have maybe like a more serious uh, story. Uh, because uh, in this episode, we got introduced, of course, to Helk, which if you just look at his character, he's almost like a really happy person that's, you know, going around and just having fun, right? But of course, once we dive deeper into his character, we see that, you know, A, he killed his brother. So is the, uh, we don't know if that's true or not. But then, of course, B, uh, he wants to become a demon lord and destroy humans. So there has to be a reason why he wants to do that, right? Especially since he's the brother of the previous hero that killed the uh, the original demon lord. So we're going to see where that story is going to go. I feel like definitely that story, depending on how they handle it, could turn out really good. But as of right now from episode one, it does seem like they're making the demons to be like the good guys, you could say. I mean, heck, even in the arena, I mean, the fact that they're accepting a human, even the possibility of a human becoming the next demon lord, hey... You know, they, I guess they don't have any hatred towards humans right now. Uh, again, all of this could be wrong. This is just my own little theory because I'm over here thinking like, you know, these are demons, right? They're supposed to hate humans, right? And humans, of course, they're supposed to hate demons. And from what we got in this episode, that's exactly what happened, right? We see that some towns are empty and then we got like, I don't know, a bunch of humans that were transforming into angels. They're attacking demon cities. Uh, so, you know, we, we need to get a little bit of history regarding this world, right? Because why are the humans and demons fighting? What's the purpose of of it but as of from what we got right now we are seeing the demons pov so it does seem like they're the good guys heck even a, a human hero kind of switched sides and wants to destroy all humans and if you've been watching anime or you know stuff like that heck even in the real world you know we humans we can uh be pretty evil so i could kind of see why Hulk wants to get rid of them but we're gonna have to wait and see definitely gonna keep planning on watching this one it was a nice little relaxing i had a couple funny moments in there as well and honestly i do like Hulk as a character i really want to find out more about him so definitely loved episode one uh, let me know what you think and like always make sure to leave a like subscribe and i will see you on the next episode peace out Bye.